Hello and welcome to Bosch Power Tools. Today we have with us GWX 17-125S. So this is a new nomenclature that you are hearing and that is GWX. So what does GWX mean in the Bosch terminology? This is coming with the world's first technology and that's X-Lock which means that you can fix the accessory and remove the accessory with a 5 inch grinding machine at ease. Uh, when I am saying at ease you must be wondering what that means. So let me just show it to you what that means. It just means that I need to pull this trigger up and I disengage the wheel. At the same time if I have to fix the wheel it is even more simpler. <clears throat> I just need to take this rotate it and that it fits at a particular slot and I just click this in. So this is GWX 17-125S. GWX stands for grinder uh, with X-Lock technology that we saw over here and uh, 17 stands because it is a 1700 watts motor inside so very powerful motor and 125 stands for the diameter of the wheel that you can fix that is nothing but 5 inches of the wheel that you can fix and S stands for speed selection and here the speed selection is at the back side so you can select your speed over here right. Uh, the tool is packed with safety features now it has got a vibration dampening handle it has got a restart protection mechanism okay and the best part is this comes with a 3 pin plug uh, which is as per uh, ISI standard and uh, the BIS compliant norm is the number is also written on the cable as well as on the plug. So this is absolutely compliant for the India region right. So that is about the tool that we have. In a conventional uh, grinding machine if you would have to change the let us say grinding wheel or a cutting wheel. So you would require nut, flange and also the key to open and to close. Uh, all this is not required so you can just put it in the dump. So with X-Lock technology uh, we can do it with ease totally hands free which means no assisting uh, tool is required to do this job. So let us try to understand how we are able to do this. So I want to remove the wheel that is already fixed. So I see this clamp over here. So all that I need to do is to pull the clamp upward okay. So I am just pulling this upward. There I have disengaged the grinding wheel okay. Now I want to fix this how do I fix this pretty simple. So take the wheel and this is a special uh, patent that is there with Bosch. So you just need to turn this on this and there will be one spot where you can see the wheel gets locked. So here it has got locked okay. Nothing that you need to do more you just need to press this down. You heard the click sound which means this is perfectly fitted in. it is not going to fall. Now we have a different question. Uh, what if I put the wheel on the other direction would this, would this work? Let us see that alright. So I again remove this okay. <coughs> I am trying to fix the wheel this way or uh, let us take a cutting wheel this time so it will be easier for us to explain. So I am trying to put the cutting wheel in the inverted fashion let us see whether it is going to fit. No. There is no place at which it is going to get locked. You see this it is failing to get locked. So which means this cannot be done in the reverse uh, direction. So now let us try to move it on this. You see it gets locked here and all that I need to do is press. So let us have some action with GWS 17-125 so the tool is here. Uh, we are going to do some grinding on this metal uh, plate that we have, have here. So let us see how, does, uh, how the work goes before that some safety. So let me put on my safety glasses and then we go.